Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a health talk type of video. Now, if you obviously see from the description below, today I'm going to be showing you guys my top favorite Instagrammers to follow on IG. I don't usually follow any exercise pages or any fitness gurus specifically because I feel like they all just repost the same things. So I love to follow exercise pages, but however, it's like they're always promoting some type of like supplement or some type of tea. I'm not here for it. I do, however, like transformation pages. I like to see like before and afters, but my favorite thing to follow is definitely nutrition pages. Nutrition is the most important thing when it comes to your diet, obviously exercises as well, but 80% of that really comes down to what you're feeding your body and knowing what's going inside of your body and how to feed it right. So I'm just gonna show you guys my top favorite five Instagrammers and maybe you guys can follow them and get some ideas ideas as far as like some meals or health tips or just inform yourself with information about nutrition. I mean, that's the most important thing, right? So let's go ahead and get started with this video. Okay, so my number one favorite person to follow is Carter Good. I'll try to insert him somewhere along this line and you guys can find his page, but he went from a journey of being completely unhealthy and then going into a healthier lifestyle. He's very informative as far as nutrition and just following your fitness goals he's super motivational he's very very realistic and i just love his page so he does a lot of comparison posts as far as like say if you're going to mcdonald's and you're gonna have like this type of meal and he'll show you the calorie intake with that type of meal and then show you the calorie intake to go more on a healthier version if you want something from mcdonald's i mean hey we like to cheat we like to have our fast food here and there so why not so here's one he did one from buffalo wild wings and he compared the Mediterranean chicken salad, which would be 1,108 calories, so 52 grams of protein, 42 grams of fat, and 70 grams of carbs, compared to eating six naked tenders and buffalo chips with um, hot barbecue sauce, side salad, and fat-free ranch, that would be 697 calories, which 48 grams of protein, 22 grams of fat, and 86 grams of carbs. So it's kind of crazy to just know the difference of it. Like you think that, oh, because I'm eating the salad, it's a lot healthier, but it's almost double. Yeah, it's literally almost double the amount of calories. Let me see if I can find a before and after. It's just really, really cool to kind of see people's before and afters. This is his before and after from 2011 to 2017. It's just really interesting to see how people went from the certain lifestyle and then change it. And it's not gonna happen overnight. Like it took me literally, what, nine months to lose 32 pounds. And I've been now doing weight training. So I'm trying not to psych myself out on the scale and take my measurements because now I'm noticing on the scale it's different, but that's because I'm building muscle. Anyways, so he's my number one favorite person to follow. Highly suggest him. Let's go on to the next one. My second favorite Instagrammer is called Truth Nutra. This page has really, really great posts. Now, one of my favorite posts that they have is called The Dirty Dozen, and then they have like another one that's comparison to this. So this post says, The Dirty Dozen, most likely to be contaminated with pesticides always buy organic now i know like if i'm buying organic i don't have to buy organic in like certain things i want to make sure i buy organic in other types of fruits and vegetables because obviously i want to stay away from pesticides then it has like another one that says the clean 15 least likely to be contaminated with pesticides and it gives you all the information on those type of things so it also has a post that says top six probiotic foods things like that i think that's really really cool so that's another page that i really love to follow and i I highly recommend to follow as well. Okay. Instagram number three. My favorite third Instagrammer is Fast Forward Amy. Now, what I really like about this page is that it's a very realistic page. It's very similar to uh, Carter Goods page as well. But for example, like this one says alcohol and weight loss. If you're drinking alcohol, you want to hydrate. Add ice. Don't be such a girl and get a lot of sugary drinks. Um, sugary drinks contain a lot of sugar, which will definitely defeat any type of weight loss. Make sure that you are stacking up in protein and obviously no snacking, but that's kind of hard to follow. Okay. Okay, and this last post, and this is just another one, a calorie comparison. If you were to eat a Oreo shake, which is 720 calories, which is 
delicious and so good but compared to eating just a soft serve ice cream on a cone would be 140 calories so she gives you really cool tips as far as like if you want to cheat go this route and not this route you know and i think that's just really cool because it allows you to indulge in a healthier way I mean, we're human. We want to go ahead and obviously have our little snacks, whether you like your sweets or your savory snacks, whatever, but just giving you pointers in how to eat more of a healthier way and still enjoy what you want to enjoy. Now, Christy Shaw is my number fourth favorite Instagram to follow. I love her. She's a personal trainer. She's an online fitness coach as well. So here she gives you a lot of tips as far as like what type of foods to make if you want to have clean eating, ready in five minute foods, like little things like that. She does exercise tips on here as well fat loss lessons so this is one of her posts where it says invest less in these and invest more in these i love all of these like she tells you don't do fad diets stop program hopping quick doing quick fixes don't negative talk yourself stop trying to use extreme methods and don't be a perfectionist and don't obsess of don't be over obsessing over the outcome because that's how you crash and then you gain all the way back when you lose it all but she says invest more in consistency feeling good healthy habits you are good enough make sure you're managing your stress have fun while you're doing it and focus on the process and the end result will obviously come so i really really love her she's probably like the only uh, I would say like fitness guru that I do follow but she does so many things on her posts and you don't see her promoting like hey fitness tea and things like that um, or like this fitness belt that's gonna help you or waist trainers she doesn't do any of that so that's why I really love her because I feel like a lot of Instagram fitness models or whatever you may call it they post too much of that and it's just it's a turn off to me I don't like it I don't like it at all and number five now this is probably mm, i would say it's like carter good and this one is probably my favorite favorite and this one is called how to count calories this by far is one of my favorite favorite pages to follow um, a lot of the posts are here like how to boost your metabolism how to organize like a prep meal if you want to do that um, it tells you the difference between different types of carbohydrates pre-workout options it's just really cool like if you don't want to rely on a protein shake like i'm not a huge fan of protein shake it tells you foods that these are all the foods that are 100 calories and how much like is in a bowl of strawberries compared to like if you're eating a bowl of popcorn or something like that very 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 informative those are definitely my favorite top five instagrammers if you guys like these type of videos where i give you tips and things that inspire me i would love to do more of them so just let me know comment down below and you don't need to to tell them I sent you or anything like that. These are just my favorite pages that inspire me, keep me informed, and don't make me feel as guilty when I want to make <laughs> unhealthy choices. So if you guys like this video, please remember to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know your thoughts, your opinions. If you guys have any favorite Instagrammers um, that you love to follow, you know, I'll be more than happy to follow them and see what they post. Did I say subscribe? Because if you have a subscribe, you should. Other than that, I don't have anything else to say. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for all your love and support. You guys seriously don't understand. I can't thank you guys enough. Um, to my true ride or dies that have been sticking along with me through my journey. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I love you guys. And until next time, bye.